हेलो एवरीवन इन द प्रीवियस वीडियोस ऑफ एएलवी वी स्टडीड बोथ द वेज टू क्रिएट ए फील्ड कैटलॉग वी यूज ऑल द थ्री फंक्शन मॉड्यूल्स टू डिस्प्ले द एएलवी आउटपुट नाउ वी ऑलरेडी कवर्ड आउट ऑफ दीस टू मेथड्स मैनुअल फील्ड कैटलॉग मेथड इज प्रेफरेबल out of these three ways to display a alv output grid display is always always preferable and most preferred by the customer now what we will do in all our topics we will use manual method of field catalog and we will use grid display function module to display the alv output in all our topics of alv now now we will start with our first requirement which customer many time ask and our first requirement is based upon sorting we will understand the requirement first this is my alv program in which we have a manual method of field catalog we are creating the field catalog manually and we are displaying the output using grid display i will not touch this existing program i will make a copy first and we will achieve one one by one when we will achieve one by one functionality i will make a copy of the program suppose in this program we will achieve the sort functionality suppose i will save this as a local object i will run this program i am giving the input to the program now you can see we can sort the data in ascending or descending order this is a inbuilt feature of alv i can sort the data in the set descending order i can sort the data in ascending order now what customer is saying i will not do any action i will not click any of i will not click on to any of these buttons whenever i will give a input and whenever i will execute my data should be automatically in descending order based upon creation date but customer is saying whenever my output is coming my data should be in ascending order of creation date it means what customer is saying he will not go for any click of these buttons whenever the output is coming he want the data to be sorted in ascending or descending order based upon the requirement it means we will achieve this requirement through the coding we will write a code for the same now if i will go to the program in the grid display function module in the grid display function module we have a dedicated parameter available it_sort we will use this parameter to achieve or to achieve the particular requirement of the customer yes customer has a customer can use ascending or descending button we all can use ascending or descending button now what customer is saying whenever the output is coming it should be in ascending or descending order based upon this particular column it means you need to write a code for the same and we will use this parameter to achieve our requirement so i will uncomment this parameter i will declare one internal table in front of this we know the type of lt_sort is same as that of it_sort so how i can check that type i will double click i will go to import 
it underscore sort is of this type. If I will check this type, it is a table type, which is referring to this structure and structure has these columns, which we will use to achieve our requirement. So firstly, I will copy this table type and I will declare in my program. So I will simply write LT underscore sort type table. It means LT underscore sort is a internal table. Now I will declare the word data. LS underscore sort type. If I will double click on the table type, this table type is referring to this structure. I will copy this structure and pass. So this is the internal table and this is the work area. I will use this to achieve our requirement. For the best understanding, I will simply open it, it in a separate window so that it will be easy for us to write the code. I will double click on this table type. This table type is referring to this structure and these are the columns. Now, I want the data to be sorted in descending order based upon creation date. So how I will write the code? ls underscore sort hyphen. What is the field name? What is the column name we need to pass? We will use this particular property, particular column on which, on which column basis you want the sorting in descending order creation date. And what is the column for the creation date? ER dat. ER dat. Now, we want the sorting in descending order. You can see up, down. Up means ascending, down mean, means descending. We want in descending order. So I will simply use down. And we know if I want to make something to true, we have to pass it to capital X. Now I will write append ls underscore sort to lt underscore sort. I will check the syntax and activate the program. Now this lt underscore sort you are passing here. So it will sort the data in descending order based upon creation date. We'll see in the debugging mode for the best understanding I will give the input, execute. Now you can see we have the LT underscore sort is blank. Now we are passing the field name down X. Now we are appending to internal table. You can see creation date is in the descending order. We are sorting that data in descending order of creation date. If I will execute, you can see our data is sorted based upon descending of creation date. 17, 16, 12, this is all. Now, suppose if we want in ascending order, so we will simply do up is equal to capital X. I will check the syntax. I will activate the program. If I will go for execute, now you can see our data is in descending, is in ascending order of creation. Maximum time, yes, customer asked this kind of requirement. So what is the summary of this topic? In this topic, we learned how to achieve the sorting in ALV through the code itself. 
with the help of code, you can achieve the sorting functionality. In the next video, we will go for next functionality. That's it in this video. Thank you.